What is going on everybody? My name is The Shig and welcome to a game called Steep. And now today we have a special guest. I am joined by the one and only Mr. McKibbish, but you can call him McKibbish. Yeah, yeah. That, fantastic intro. How's it going <laughs> Thank you. guys? It is going great today. We are going to play uh, Steep. This yep. is an open beta game by Ubisoft, which... Um, do you know more about this game than I do? Because uh, I literally haven't heard nothing until you told me about not it. Not a lot. It's only just come out on closed beta. So, no one, not many people have got it. I'm yeah. Sure. Um, oh, fuck, I did a trick. Whew. It's Ubisoft's first sports game, as far as I'm aware. Yeah, I can't say yeah. I've ever heard of any by them. No. And, no, so far it looks pretty good. Well, uh, this is the first time that I've ever played it. Obviously, you've played it quite a few times before, McKibbish. So, would you like to just uh, tell us about some of the functions? Alright, well, as you can see right now, we're snowboarding. That's a, that's a function. <laughs> uh, yeah, the terrible walking functions, that's but terrible. we won't talk about that. Um, uh, there's four different things we can use. Yeah. So yeah, this isn't you, necessarily you, um, just a snowboarding game, it's obviously you got to... Yeah. If you hold back on the controller so we can get him to stop. Oh, we can stop? Yeah. Yeah. Even though I'm going downhill, I'm going to stop in midair. Yeah, Amazing. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I can't, I'm ragdolling, right. man. I'm hold ragdolling. triangle, we'll go back to the beginning. Alright, we're All right. back. We're not back. Oh, here we go. go. Alright, so if we go into office. our options, our one. Our one? Okay. Yeah, our Alright, well, let's get into the walk can... and get to somewhere a bit safer than yeah, the edge of a cliff. You may want to hold down R2. Oh, of course, the sprint. Yeah, the, oh. the epic sprinting. It's a good job there is no zombies in this game. I don't think we would survive that long. Oh, oh this oh. guy just appeared. Oh, out yeah. Nowhere. Look at his head. Um, is that open his online thing, so. Once Dude you has got a chicken on his head. <laughs> oh, wow, that's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, once you've completed the oh, tutorial fuck. on this, <laughs> oh, um, yeah. it's straight into online. There's no like single player mode by the looks of things. But uh, there is missions or yeah. anything like that. Yeah, you can see off in the distance, a couple of missions over there. Have you actually done like any of the little like yeah, what the that, icons yeah. are coming up? Are they yeah. races or stuff like that? Well, there's loads of things. There's like you got your races, your time attacks, um, score. Right, uh, score point things. So just like anything yeah. that you'd want in some any sort of like sports game, yeah. they generally just sound like the sort of racing games where you have all the time trials yeah. and everything like that. Yeah. Is there anything unique about this that you might say would be different than something? Oh, um, well, definitely all these like the wingsuits. Oh yeah, stuff. definitely. I can't say I've ever flown around like that before. <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't know. The way they've got the whole trick system set up for like when you're snowboarding is quite unique. I'll have to get you into a trick thing so you can try it out. So is it going to be like a, a sort of Tony Hawk sort of where you're pushing buttons to do combos I or...? I thought it was more like skate because you use um, you use your trigger buttons to jump and then you're using your analog sticks left and right to like spin the board and grab onto things. Oh, as well oh, as right. using the triggers again once you're in the air to the triggers to grab and yeah. then your analog sticks to spin around and stuff. Oh, so if what you hold down RT, you yeah, I mean, that's mode. why I'm in stunt mode, which just seems yeah. to go wild with it. You can do backflips, but you can't do front flips. Ready to land. Oh, okay, let's just pick it up. Yeah. You can do backflips? Yeah. You get a oh, good swing me. that way and then just go. <laughs> oh, just keep going. Shit. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. So I can just backflip all the way down the mountain. Yeah. Marvelous. Marvelous. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's uh, hit up one of these all things. Right. Is, is, that, you... oh. is that a guy down there? Uh, that looks like a guy. Yeah. Oh, okay. Is there any interaction then? I know this is just a beta, but... Um, you can mash X. Mash X. Yeah. It, it's kind of interesting how the snow does sort of move around you. Yeah. That's you know the first thing I did when I got into this game? What's that? Wrote fuck in the snow. <laughs> <laughs> just quickly, go to where you were a second ago, where that guy is, and zoom right in. R2. Oh, zoom. R2. It's... Okay. This is such a cool feature, I thought. Oh, you can actually see where all like the players are. Yeah, you can zoom in and watch them go down the mountain. Oh, okay. Oh, that is pretty cool. I see. That's like a. Uh, oh, he's being a bit laggy. Maybe on. Uh, no, he's know. been standing there the whole time. You oh, I think actually... that's an NPC for when you start doing that. Oh, right? the yeah, that is a, like yeah. a racy thing here. So, yeah. is this like all the places which we stand? Was that saying? Yeah, that's um your previous like walk. Points and you can just like fast travel back to it. Yeah. Okay. Can, I think you can set up like little um, 
gaps and tricks and stuff along those lines and like that as well. Yeah, so with the actual, uh, there's some structures in it, like we've got this one here. Can yeah. you fast travel to that, or is that something that you actually uh, have to head to yourself to be able to... Certain ones, by the looks of things, as, as you progress through the game, it looks like you unlock different places which you can fast travel to, but then ah, yeah. other things, you can't. So it's not like a case of you just visit it and then it's added to your fast travel list. No, no. Uh, saucy hobo with us. Saucy hobo. Yeah. Is why he sent us a message. Oh, okay. Is he on this map with us now? Then? I think, yeah. Oh, there, there, yeah, there he is. You. Okay, then. Which, so that's kind of neat. Can you fast travel to your friends then? You, um, you've done much with that? I think you can, but I haven't figured it out yet. Alright, how do um, I grab the board real quick? Uh, when you're in the air, mash R2 or, or L2. Oh, okay. Yeah. I see, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, um, let's bring up another quick little feature once you get to the finish line oh, here. Oh god! Oh nice. <laughs> <laughs> if you um, press down on the D-pad and you've got someone in your group, yeah. you can have groups when you're online and that. Yeah, I've seen that. Then, like you'll you'll then stuff. start spectating them. Oh, okay, that's pretty neat. Yeah. I thought it was quite a nice little feature. So if you find a guy that's just tearing shit up. Yeah, get in his group, hit spectate, you can watch that shit all day. Yeah. So with this, obviously I've just finished the event. Can I now hold triangle to try again to go yeah. back to the yep. top of that event? Yep. So you can literally just come back and forth as many times as you want. Yeah, until you got that gold. This does seem like a really fun game though. I like that. It, obviously they've gone for like the scheme thing, but they've added more stuff in than just something like back when they had whatever SSX, yeah. where it's obviously just all snowboarding. We've well, obviously yeah. got the ski Missed option. one again, by the way. <laughs> Oh, well, who cares? We'll just get to the end Go of this route. Gap. through that gap. Yeah, that, that's the main thing. But the fact that they added in, like, this swirl suit... Oh, oh <laughs> KO'd. Uh, 8,000 Gs in Dura Dura game. Oh, yeah, that's a great feature as well. The Gs. Jesus. And so, the kind of all that reminds me of is, like, with the Skate Free. Yeah, and obviously they have the pain thing. Yeah. yeah. But it just, like, tells you how much Gs does it ever give you any sort of representation of, like, what that is? In, cause no. Not everyone knows about Gs. No, unfortunately, no. Uh, it, I'd hope with the main game there might be something like Skate, where you see the broken bones or something. Yeah, yeah, that's why yeah. I wanted to know about, it. obviously, you tell us about the Gs, because that is a pretty cool little thing that they have yeah. in the Skate game there. Hopefully we'll nail this right now, and then we'll come to the end of this little uh, play, let's review or so. Okay. Well, <laughs> I suck. Do you want to have a quick go and see All if you right, can make it through there? So you get points for a lot of stuff. Are these points used, or is there any um, sort of currency that has been in it? Points seem... Oh, no. I missed that one. Points, you can use them to buy, like, new suits and... Yeah. So it is used as, like, a yeah. currency sort of thing. Yeah. Is there any upgrading on the character as of um, now? Uh, sit, there's like a um, level up system. Ooh. Oh, that's <laughs> a hard <laughs> gap, yeah. Yeah, you've got your level up system. If I can go into the menu here quickly, um, and you've got lots of gear you can buy. So is it yeah. just the gear that does the actual level up themselves, no, or is you, there a skill tree? It seems there is an actual skills and stuff. Next oh, level. is that what this yeah. is? Yeah, so I've already maxed out for the demo. Yeah, or the beta. So I think where it started it, you start off with this little bit here. Yeah. So there's, there's like these little white lines going around each bit. I think that's how it, it progresses. It's gonna like put it in into different zones and yeah. stuff. But there's no loading screens between these. You could start over here and come all the way over to the other side without a single loading screen. Which is pretty much what you want in a yeah. game nowadays. Yeah, it's lovely. So the game seems pretty cool. I mean, it's got a lot going for it. It's got like a school tree. You got places to unlock. Obviously, the four different ways of traveling around with all the different events and everything. So yeah. it does seem like it's going to be quite an entertaining game. Is there any features that you've found so far that you've really enjoyed about it? Uh, oh, well, I enjoyed pretty much all of it, apart from what just happened there. Oh, going the, over the rocks. The rocks. Yeah. Yeah, this is the only problem I have with this game is the rocks. You go over a rock, you see on the left hand side my G Force starts going up. And he just bails. Where is that coming up? Is that in the bottom left there or is that the uh, point? It's on the left okay. side of him. See so Oh the, oh there, I see, yeah. yeah, actually to the left of him. Okay. Yeah. That is quite interesting then. Yeah. Well, I don't know much about actual real snowboarding. 
So if you do snowboarding or anything like that yourselves, please leave in the comments below what rocks actually do to you so we can understand this more. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure it's not comfortable riding over rocks, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure it's not going to knock you out. <laughs> So obviously we've been on the snowboard a lot, are you able to get onto the skis now oh, yeah. that you're halfway doing the mountain or do you uh, actually have to be stopped? You have to stop. But you can just switch out. Yeah, I was hoping you'd be able to like switch out in mid-air, go like yeah. from snowboard to um, <laughs> wingsuit or something. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, you see that, um, the g-force on the left again. Just yeah, yeah. The rocks. That's cool. And obviously the tricks work exactly the same on skis as they do on snowboards. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> wow. That has a full-on ragdoll mechanic for falling down the whole mountain. Has there ever been a case where you just started, like, falling off near the top and ended up down the bottom in oh, the ragdoll? Or you can ragdoll for down? so long, it's, it's ridiculous. And is there a way to stop it if you wanted to, or do you actually have to triangle. reset? Yeah, yeah, just go straight back. <laughs> yeah, uh, I've done terribly here. It's like 12,000. I've, I've got 1,000. And I'm going backwards. Nice. Finish oh, well, that's pretty cool then. Right then. Well, this looks like a pretty cool game. I mean, I like the features in it all. That might be something that I'll look to play more for the channel. But right now, that will probably end this video here. Is there nothing else you'd like to add on to the actual yeah. game itself? Uh, I think we're good. Yeah? Do we know where does it have a release date or anything like that? I'm not sure. We're not I sure. We'll have to have a look and then put it in the description or something. Yeah. Okay, well that's cool. I'll have a look for that later on. But obviously uh, today we've been joined by Mikibish. If you yeah. want to uh, see more of him, he has a channel. He doesn't upload that much, but you can still yeah. check it out. That'll be in the description below. It'll also link you to his Twitter in case you'd like to follow yeah. people on there as well. But apart from that, thank you for coming on to the Sheik channel. And for showing us this game. No worries. Alright then, well, awesome, peace guys. out, guys. Yeah, peace out. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out for that rock. And that tree. Man, this is getting a little tactical about which way to run now, because there's all obstacles all up in my way and stuff. Are we going into a forest? I thought we were looking for a temple. What about if I happen to find the wrong titan? Is that a thing? Can I run into not the next up titan? Why do I keep calling them titans? The classy.